Princess Eugenie and her new husband Jack Brooks Fink are said to have broken strict protocol on public displays of affection after they were photographed holding hands during the Queen's Christmas Day church outing. Princess Eugenie and Mr. Brooks Bank, who wed in October in a lavish wedding similar to that of Prince Harry and Meghan Markle in Windsor, joined the royal family for a Christmas Day church outing. The couple were clearly in love and gazed at each other as they arrived at church on the Queen's Sandringham estate. But they actually broke royal protocol when they were pictured holding hands as they made their way into the church, much to the dismay of the Queen herself. Although it is not entirely frowned upon to hold hands while in public, the newlyweds broke protocol by holding hands and flaunting personal displays of affection in front of the Queen herself. Royal biographer Giles Brandreth told People, her Majesty almost never holds hands with her husband Prince Philip due to the stoic values of their generation. Queen Elizabeth and her husband Prince Philip never show affection in public. Despite being married for 70 years they are never seen holding hands. Younger royals such as Prince Harry and Meghan Markle are often pictured showing PDAs to each other, even being photographed while engaging in romantic kisses. But, in addition to maintaining decorum around Her Majesty, the younger generation of royals refrain from holding hands around the monarch to show respect. Mike Amir, founder of Beaumont Etiquette, told people that the rules differed between each generation of royals and also between the couples themselves. Mr. Micah said, it is rare to see royal couples holding hands on official outings. While we are much less likely to see the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge holding hands in public, we often see Prince Charles and the Duchess of Cornwall holding hands, it's all simply a matter of preference for each couple and is also likely dependent on the nature of the event they are attending. A more serious engagement would warrant a more serious level of professionalism, which each royal is sure to follow.